Hello there, today we're at Peacehaven Community School and today we're going to be learning about nerve impulses. Nerve impulses are important um, transmissions or signals that pass through our body from our brain to various muscles and other components that allow us to send signals and information to and from um, the brain. In our model today, we're going to be using these crazy white guys um, called the nerve impulse. These guys are going to be flooding down from one neuron and then passing their signals onto the next neuron itself. The nerve impulse is then going to um, talk to the neurotransmitters. Neurotransmitters flood into the synapse and they connect with neurotransmitter receptors. Okay? So the neurotransmitter receptors sit down and then they can pass on their information to the next neuron. Okay? Later on in the video as well, we're going to be looking at the effect of drugs in, within the system itself and how these effects can obviously slow our reactions down. Um, we're going to use a model and um, we're going to go through step by step of how it works. The junction between two neurons is called the synapse, so this gap here. The neuron before the synapse is called the presynaptic neuron. The neuron after the synapse is called the postsynaptic neuron. It is on this postsynaptic neuron is which the neurotransmitter receptors lie. The neurotransmitters want to come in and then send the signal to the next neuron. Okay? Up here we've got a nerve impulse to travel very, very quickly. And down here are neurotransmitter receptors. They flood the synapse and then they try to connect to a neurotransmitter receptor. Any that aren't used up are recycled. Then we've got a wave of activity again. Neuro impulse go. I'm going to be demonstrating what drugs do on the nervous system. Once they have blocked the neurotransmitter um, receptors, the nerve impulse then comes down and attaches to the neurotransmitters. The neurotransmitters flood the synapse again and are then blocked by the neuro, um, drugs on the neurotransmitter receptors. They are then recycled into the presynaptic neuron and as a consequence, the next nerve impulse cannot work. 